How y'all doing? I hope everybody's doing great. I'm doing absolutely fantastic. Um, I'm just coming back here. I got a little piece of mail I want to show, and I also have some eBay pickups I'd like to go through. That's why I left the bank, the back here, all blank, so I can just toss things up as I uh, as I show them to you guys. But I'm, let me show this piece of mail if I can kind of block dude's address and mine. Uh, Brady Mitchell. I'll put his name in the. Uh, I'll put a link below uh, if you guys want to check this dude out. Uh, he's just been doing it for a little while now. and He's just been just been a great kid. Really like this kid. Uh, but let's see what Brady sent. I, try and tear through this real quick. Okay, we got a note here. Uh, channel name, Brady Mitchell. Uh, that's his autograph right there. Who dat? He's a Saints fan for shizzle. And, oh, okay. Uh, thanks for your package. I hope you enjoy these as my collection isn't very big. I don't think this can top you. Don't even worry about that, dude. Oh, my goodness. I just send what I can, man. Uh, and that's what everybody should do. Uh, package, uh, but I still want to send something your way. Brady Mitchell, very good dude. Once again, I'll leave a link for dude's channel. He's got, okay, He's got. we got a stapled pack here. It's got a... A note on it here it says look for youtuber signatures well look at that one of one youtuber signatures one out of every three thousand man that's that's pretty pretty tough odds man i don't know if i'll get a youtuber signature with with odds like that buddy we got a piece of gum and let me just shuffle these real quick and he sent me a johnny peralta so that's pretty cool oh man look at that back that's what i'm talking about I, I don't care how cool. I love a cool looking front, man, but I think all backs should look like this, like old school. That's really neat right there. We have a Brooke Jacoby. Not completely familiar with this cat, probably because this is a bit of an older product. Yeah, 88. I didn't watch a ton of baseball in 88. Been watching a lot of it lately. I hate to see that the Indians let one slip by the uh, yesterday the way they did. Such a close game. We have uh, Corey Kluber, so that's very nice of you, Brady. I really appreciate that. <clears throat> And we have this Trevor Bauer, so that's awesome. And a Michael Brantley. That's really cool, man. And then he gave me the uh, the awesome, uh, so I guess I hit it, man. I mean, one out of 3,000, and I was lucky enough to pull one of these uh, 101 uh, silver signatures of Brady Mitchell. Uh, authentic autograph. I hope so, man. I hope this was an auto pen, dude. Um... It may have said something on the back, but I think he scribbled it out there. But that's very cool, man. I greatly appreciate that. That That's worth more than the cards, always and forever. Thank you so much for sending to me, bro. And don't mention what I sent to you, man. It was just, you know, I just what I had to send. You gave me a list of what you wanted, and I have a huge box I keep where of just, it's just full of cards I don't want. And when somebody, you know, when we do the cool care package thing, I just dip into the box of stuff that I really don't want for my collection and send it out to you guys. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna try not to make this too long. So I have a ton of stuff really I could show from eBay pickups that I've been getting over the la course of the last couple months. But uh, I'm not gonna show them all because I'd like to try and stop this at around. Uh, five or six minutes or so to make it easy to watch for everybody but uh check that out huh and it, it came to me in this screw down and i probably will take it out but this is my first ever uh barry sanders patch card this was only like 18 bucks and i feel like i stole it it's modeled after a 1989 tops and uh very cool my the, the only uh downside of this is i wish i could have got two of them so i could have sent one to spartan dogs so shout out to spartan dogs right there man tell me that ain't cool <clears throat> i should have put it in a in a I should have took it out of this so I could show it a little bit better, but I'm not going to monkey around unscrewing it now. It'll just be a big waste of time. But, man, is that cool or what? A patch of Barry Sanders. I'll tell you what, I'm going to cherish that thing. My all-time favorite player. And then uh, this is brought to you by way of watching Antonio Colazzo's videos. I've seen him uh, open, uh, or rather, get a Peyton Manning of this. And I, I hurried up and went on eBay and tried to see if I could find a Dan Marino one. And I was lucky enough to find one. And uh, this was only like five or six bucks. And I mean, these things are just... Let me pull this out. We'll Colazzo it a little bit for everybody. These are gorgeous. These are those um, hollow um, GRFX graphics from... Uh, Upper deck, I do believe, yeah. Yeah, I mean, these are sharp cards. I would advise anybody, if you've got an older player from the uh, 90s that you really like a lot, go see if you can grab one of these things because, you know, I've got some player going on here and this doesn't do it the justice it it should. Um, this is a beautiful card. Very nice. 
And we'll set that right there for now. We'll get through as many of these as I can. Um, I'll give it one more minute and I'll have to throw the rest of this stuff in another vid. But um, I'm trying to get all the really good players that came out. Or, the, or I should say that 80, they came out in 88 and 89. And both falling on that cusp of their rookie cards being in the 89 sets. And uh, really wanted this uh, Thurman Thomas. I got that finally. Very cool. I think this was just a few dollars. Uh, he is vastly unappreciated. At least in value. Because Thurman, Thurman Thomas was awesome. And uh, I picked this up too. And again, all these were months ago. Um, finally, finally getting a chance to show them. Uh, I finally got my first Flawless because I didn't have any Flawless. And I thought, what a better Flawless to get than Malcolm Mitchell. And uh, this is just a sweet card. Flawless is beautiful stuff. This is number 14 out of only 15. Just a great um, one, two, three, four color patch right there with a ton of stitching that I like. Tell me Flawless ain't beautiful because that thing is awesome. Very stoked to get that. Plus, I think, you know, Malcolm, even though they did sign... Uh, Cooks, man. Malcolm still got a shot at being great. So here's a yet yet again. I'm trying to get all those cool 89 guys from the 89 score rookies um, in my collection, and I never had a Michael Irvin. So there's a Michael Irvin right there. It's only a graded eight. Uh, tell me your opinion. I'm actually considering popping this thing out of there because I'm you know since it's an eight, I mean, and and it just won't fit in my box. You know what I'm saying? But I'll show one more card and then we'll end it here. I also got this. I am in love with these uh, numbered rookie cards from Plates and Patches. So I picked up a Jordan Howard one. And this one's numbered at a 79. Just absolutely beautiful cards. Um, but that's it. I'm going to end this so it's not real terribly long. And we'll, I'll show the rest of these some other time. Uh, thank you all for watching, supporting, and all that happy stuff. And I'll see you on the other side of the glass. Peace out.